Yeah, hello. Little variety here called chalk, the effect. Okay, this journal is your your own jailer, and it's from 5-22-2010, the second of the day. The Mayan day was nine vulture or wisdom. Okay, I want to put in a word for my transcripts. Actually, they are my journals, you know. This video stuff came along second. It's quite fun to do, and I love it, but back to the transcripts. As you know, they're all over on Scribed, which is a great site, but here's the deal. I have a lot of readers there, yet no one rates them or comments, so I'd like to ask you to do that. I put my heart into them. Adding links you'll find useful, if not now, then perhaps later, so give them a look sometime. And be sure to rate them, please. Up or down, I don't care. It's funny, but with over 12,000 reads, not one rating. And I just got tired of waiting, so I'm asking. Please do that. Thanks a bunch. Moving on. Oh yes, and of course, rate the vids too. Don't want to push you, but here's the deal. It's an energy that flows between you and me, and when you get that good feeling, you may not feel like commenting, may not even know what to say, and that's fine. But if you give me a rating, then it closes a loop, a small cycle there that connects us up. It's gratitude flowing, and it flows all the stronger when we give it vent, let it express. It's a blessing to you, not just me. Hope you see how this works for both of us. Both benefit. Gratitude flows from the heart, you know. Check it out. Next time you feel it flowing, drop down into it. Settle down. Be with it. Feel it flow. It may even bring tears to your eyes. No surprise if you're into it. Powerful stuff. Gratitude is love, just expressed from a certain perspective or angle. Just like we say I to mean I, but we could also say I, E-Y-E, -E, well, the divine qualities are like that. They are eyes of the divine, but they're also eyes, E-Y-E-S, ways that she sees. Being all love, every way that she bees has that love in it. Love is it. So, all divine graces and qualities have this, just as gratitude does. It's of heart. Come in, my dears, the water's just fine. Drop down into heart space and live. What you're doing now is not living, my dear, if it's not from here, not from heart. You're only alive when you've found and awakened to who you are, what this is. You'll never define it, but experience is there for you to enter it. Have a set. Take your throne, take your scepter, and then take your life back, friends. You can do this. Make your own choices about life. Don't let them be forced or foisted on you by others, by society, by some government or organization or another. Heck with that. Take the reins. You're not small like they've told you and schooled you to believe and accept. You're not that. All a lie from the start to the end and the middle. Yep, it's <gasps> bullshit. Sorry, dears, but they're apt words. Actually, the real thing is at least useful on the garden. This other is thoroughly worthless. Let it go. Step into your cosmic beinghood, dears. Just give yourself the possibility this is true, and why not? What's to lose? Just your small self, 
It's only an image. It's not true, not a bit, but your belief that gave it power. Yes, power over you. You're your own jailer, my dear. Fancy that. Well, you've got the key, too. You've had it all along, so now use it, please. Enter heart. Now you're home. Things are so different in heart space. They are not the same at all. Nothing is. Welcome home. Let the old vision go. Let it flow off away as you settle down. Take your throne all your own. No one can assail you. Here you reign supreme. So relax, my friend. Thrones your own. Enter in. The way that you reign here is first by observing and then you'll see its will and intent. Evidence of power, all your own. Okay, I don't want to go on long here. Links to the other journals are in the transcript to help you dive into the subject as deeply or as shallow as you like. Up to you. Get used to reigning, do. Make your own decisions. Up to you. But more so than that, get the feeling of just how magnificent you really are. Feel good about your choices, your decisions you make. Just appreciate them. Enjoy taking the path that you take, no matter which way it goes. It doesn't matter. You're the thing, you see. You can't be judged by what you think, do, or say. That's not you. Enter heart. It's a whole new way of living. And like I said at the start, come on in. The water's fine.